all men are created equal. This is the basic principle of a democratic society. That means that all of us, rich or poor, able or disabled, we all have our rights. And children have their rights too. The right to survive, to develop, and to participate. The ancient strategy mandates that we have to make all these rights real for children and for persons with disabilities. And this exhibit provides a social venue for all of them to be known and to be uh, accepted by the community. It makes us see that children with disabilities have also talents and they need our support so that these talents can be developed, they can survive and participate in our communities. Bata pa lang siya, pinakitaan ko na siya ng ano eh, ng uh, paghilig sa drawing. At the age of 7 years old, nagdo-draw-draw na siya. Pero, yun lang, lack of gamit. So, true pencil lang ang ano niya. Hindi ko pa nakikita yung talagang galing niya. At the age of 8, 9, medyo may color na siya kahit papano. So, no, nakikita ko na na meron siyang ano na mag-draw talaga. Hanggang sa pagdating ng grade 5, uh, doon na yung dumating yung time na nakakabili na kami kahit pa paano ng mga gamit. So, isinali ko na rin siya sa, sa mga contest-contest. Although, ayaw ko nga sana, dahil ayaw ko ng, ng tinatawag nating discrimination, di ba? Uh, tulad niya, pwede siyang uh, i-discriminate, kumbaga, yun lang ang hindi ko talaga gusto nun. Pero, uh, dahil sa gusto niya talaga, so, inano ko pa rin siya na makasali. Nanonalo naman siya sa poster making contest sa, sa elementary days niya uh, hanggang ngayong high school. Ah, ah. Mm. Nagsimula pa siya ng mag-drawing uh, painting yung second trench ng pandemic po. Yun po, yung nag-start kasi sobrang 
boring na siya kaya mag-request sa akin ng scrapbook at uh, lapis at mag-drawing na lang ako siya kaya pinag-anuhan ko po, pinilaan ako siya ng ano para lang makapagsimula kaysa mag-sell po ng mag-sell <laughs> kaya yun na lang po yun na <laughs> ako po pala si Erben John F. Lopez na um, 16 years old po uh, nahilig po ako sa art po um, since nung grade 3 pa po hindi um, naman po ganun kagaling mag drawing and natuto lang po na gumanda yung drawing ko po since nung nagkaroon po ako ng mga kaibigan nung, nung nag grade 7 na po ako sila po yung nagtulong sa akin mag improve yung mga drawings ko and doon po natuto mag painting and makapagsalam mo ako sa ibang mga kaibigan uh, magandang araw po ako po si Cyril Panilag na mother po ni Erwin Jan. Um, ako ay na, nakita ko po yung kanyang potential no pandemic. Yung pandemic po ay por, ano pag boring ko siya, yung drawing ko yung kanyang ina, ano, yung ginagawa. Pag wala po siyang magawa, walang mga kaibigan na pumunta dito dahil nga po naghiwalay na sila. Yun, drawing po siya. Nagdo-drawing na lang po dito mag-isa sa bahay. Sabi ko, anak, ang ganda na drawing mo Mas ano pa sa iba ah. Kahit sabi mo, may diferensya yung kamay mo, magaling ka pa rin mag-drawing sa kanila. Yun lang. Inaano ko lang sa kanya, sinusuportahan ko lang po kung anong kahiligan niya. Para makatulong sa kanya, para matanggal yung stress niya sa bahay. Ako po si John Rio J. Camanya. 17 years old po ako at mahilig po ako mag-drawing. Hello po, ako po si Jason Camanya, father po ako ni John Ryu, Jay Camanya po. No? So, John Ryu started drawing or scribbling when he was about 6 or 7 years old. So, ang mga unang gawa niya is about so Angry Birds, then Plants vs. Zombies or Scribbles. Uh, ngayon lang, thanks to Birthright, na ipakita ng mga anak ko yung kanyang talents. No? So, Uh, thank you, Birthright, kasi sa mga sa ginawa nyo, dahil labas ng anak ko ang talent niya. Ang na-develop pa niya yung talent niya. Lalo na si landscaping, because mahina siya sa landscaping. Ngayon niya na-appreciate na, hey, I could do this pala. I could shade this correctly. Even though nandun ang frustration, okay nandun yung beautiful. Pero maraming salamat because of you guys, He was able to do much better today, and he will improve much better sa mga sisirin. Thank you! Thank you. Thank you. Om Shri Saira, my name is Priya Murugesan, Secretary of Shri Satisa International Organization, Philippines. Our organization is a spiritual and humanitarian organization serving Filipinos and the communities in Philippines for over three decades now. Our organization works on the motto, Love All, Serve All. So it was very apt in partnering with Birthright Foundation for this specific art exhibition which supports the art therapy of differently abled and special children of God. The Birthright Educators Foundation has been one of the solid partners of the Muntinlupa Persons with Disability Affairs Office. Since we started in 2019, Birthright has been there with us in the grassroots to advocate inclusion, solve problems, and develop programs for persons with disability. This Hope in Colors project is one of our most inspiring projects to date. Mayor Jaime R. Fresnedi and the City Government of Muntinlupa is 100% supporting disability development in our locality. Our art exhibition titled Hope in Colors will be open from November 22 to 26, 
At Star Mall, third floor, SLX Milton Lupa, we highly encourage all of you to come out and check this beautiful art exhibit of our wonderful children. Each one is a unique and special creation. Please come and buy them and support the art therapy of these differently abled and special children of God.